Let's face it, most come to an aircraft convention to see new aircraft. And Heli Expo 2015 doesn't disappoint there. Flying into the convention grounds for the first time, the Augusta Westland 609 tilt rotor. This is one of two flying prototypes. The other is in Italy. Here at the convention, Augusta Westland announced that production AWS 609s will be built in Philadelphia. And the test pilot says it's going to be one heck of a bird. We can be a helicopter or we can be an aircraft, which means that we can fly 250 knots, in excess of 250 knots, uh, get, up, get above the weather, we're pressurized, we can fly 25,000 feet, uh, and we can get there faster, we can go further than the helicopter can, um, and we can go above the weather as well, so you don't have to fly through the weather. So if you take all that into account, who are the people who are going to be able to want to do that? Um, VIP world, uh, going from you know, helipad to helipad, DC heli helipad to New York helipad, London helipad to a, Mon to a Monaco helipad. Um, oil and gas, uh, you can take people uh, a lot quicker, a lot further um, than you can in a helicopter, but still land on, on, the heli on the helipad on the oil rig. Can do search like an airplane, can do rescue like a helicopter. Now you might be wondering, how hard is it to pilot this helicopter airplane hybrid? You've got to remember, we fly by wire, and uh, the flight control designers have spent a lot of time making the aircraft easy to fly. Um, so some, some of the, uh, the crucial phases are more helicopter-like. I think a helicopter pilot might find it a little easier to fly as long as he had some idea about how to operate at high altitude as an airplane. But we're confident we could take anybody. Both uh, Dan, my colleague, and I are both uh, IPs, uh, and we don't see any problem in, the in doing the training for either fixed wing or rotary wing. Augusta Westland expects to certify the 609 in late 2017.